In the past, the question of what's next was always filled with excitement and promise. But just like everything else, it seems that this question has taken on new meaning in the midst of the COVID-19 pandemic. Rather than signaling hope, this question now represents all of the anxieties of our new normal. What's next for my family? What's next for my health? What's next for this country, the economy, the world? This pandemic has brought so much uncertainty, but it's also highlighted two great needs that have been overshadowed for far too long. Dedicated healthcare professionals and mental health awareness. First, it's now more apparent than ever that nurses are essential to our society, which has been made evident by the tragic consequences of our nation's nursing shortage during a global pandemic. Second, this pandemic has shaken our society to its core. We've lost so many things that we took for granted, going to school, working out at the gym, socializing with our friends, all things we rely on to maintain our mental health. This pandemic has restricted our old way of life and produced infinite new anxieties, resulting in an unprecedented wave of mental illness. While ending this terrible pandemic is our immediate focus, we need to prepare for years of psychological impact ahead. At this time of such great need, I'm so excited to continue my education at Columbia University's School of Nursing, where I will pursue a doctorate of nursing practice in order to achieve my dream of becoming a psychiatric nurse practitioner. Ever since I can remember, I've been interested in understanding how our minds work. I was fascinated by how psychology could unlock the world around me. However, like many young adults today, I witnessed so much suffering caused by mental illness as I grew up. By the time I entered college, I knew I wanted to dedicate my life to helping people find relief from their disorders, which led me to the Honor Psychology program at Vanderbilt University. I began working for psychological labs to develop my understanding of the research behind disorders and their treatments. This in-depth exposure inspired me to complete an independent thesis on the impacts of childhood trauma on cognitive functioning. All these incredible research experiences helped me develop a deeper understanding of the science behind mental illness. I realized that a career in academia would not satisfy my professional desires. While volunteering at St. Thomas Hospital in Nashville, I had the opportunity to work directly with patients and staff, watching the nurses positively impact countless lives each and every day. From then on, I knew that becoming a psychiatric nurse practitioner would enable me to realize all of my professional aspirations by allowing me to directly serve my community, and I've been working towards that goal ever since. This summer, I will begin working towards my Master's of Science at Columbia University School of Nursing, allowing me to become a registered nurse. I'm starting classes online in May, and when it's safe to do so, I plan on moving to New York City to begin in-person classes and clinical rotations. In this capacity, I'll be able to immediately serve where I'm needed the most, joining the fight against COVID-19 by caring for patients and supporting healthcare workers who are already on the front lines. After completing my master's, I will enter the doctoral phase of my education, specializing in psychiatric care. Earning a doctorate degree will allow me to serve as a nurse practitioner giving me the full autonomy to treat my patients with medication and psychotherapy. My career will allow me to support the medical community during our present pandemic, while also fulfilling my aspirations of helping relieve the suffering of patients with mental illness. These days, there are so many unknowns. I don't know when life will go back to normal, when I can go back to volunteering at the hospital, or when I can move to begin my new life at Columbia. I don't know when the economy will recover, or when at-risk populations will no longer have to fear walking in public. What I do know is that I'm headed for a career that will allow me to make a difference in the world. And I can't wait for what's next.